Hi guys, in this lecture I'm going to show you how to use the keyboard shortcuts. First of all, if you want to create a line, but you want a lot easier from moving the mouse to the line and then going back here, you can only type L and you can see that there's some options in here. We can always press the first thing and you can see that the line command has been activated. You can create a line, press enter, it is created. So again, let's do it together. Press L and then enter. A line and then enter. See, as easy as that. Now, what if you want to create a circle? Let's press or type C. As you can see, we have like the circle. Press enter. You can see that there is a lot of circles. See again, enter. See, very easy. What if you want to create a polyline? So, you can press P, L, C. This is the P line, which refers to polyline. Press enter, and you can see that this is the polyline. Enter, C, this is the polyline. So, L for line, C for circle, and then PL for the polyline. Okay? What if you want to create a rectangle? Okay. Type R, E, you can see rectangle. And now you can create a rectangle. Again, R, E, move down once, enter. And then do the rectangle. Again, together, R, E, then move down, press enter, and then you can create your rectangle. And this is for the shortcuts for the small things. We have some other shortcuts. Like if you want to erase, you can press E and then enter. As you can see, you can press this and then enter. This is for the erase. Okay, other things. The move and the rotate and the trim commands and the mirror, the copy. I'm going to explain them when I explain these commands, okay? But for the drawing commands, let's do it again. L for the line, PL for the polyline, C for the circle, and RE for the rectangle. We have some arches. Let's type AR. Just press A and then enter. You can see you can create your arc. As simple as that. See? And that's it for the drawing shortcuts on the keyboard.